All right, ladies and gentlemen, Marla Molina is super stunning, looking really, really good. Now, I do want to say a couple of things about Jeffree Star. I mean, lately I felt really bad for him. He's had, he's been robbed by his boyfriend, and he's got someone doing parodies on him, and it's just like, it's sad, you know, and you're just like, oh, that's terrible. He's doing very, very well, though, on terms of his uh, YouTube and all that, but it's just sad, you know, you're like, oh, poor guy, you know, but... Yeah, he's so, um, you know, and I mean, the thing is, people can be so mean. You know, even though he's famous and doing well, people want to take, to, to, to make him feel small, you know, and it's just like, that's crazy, you know, like, honestly, a shout out to Jeffree Star, um, and I hope he does well. Well, I, I don't know him or anything, but a shout out to how he, he's doing well. I mean, for me, I just, I just see that and I'm like, oh, you know, it's really sad, you know, like, his boyfriend robbed him. I mean, that's, that's like, you know, he, he's a very successful and, you know, that's, that's just obviously hurts his feelings, you know, but, but, you know, and sometimes you just think these people are, are made of steel and they can do well, but, but really they're, they're struggling too sometimes, you know, so it's not like you can really pinpoint, um, you know, when someone's successful, how they're going to be doing well, is that they're, they're going to have no issues or no problems. You know, Jeffree Star has, has even, he was even hacked at one point with his account. So, I mean, you know, that's sad, you know. But they won't even do something like that, you know. But he's a very friendly guy. Poor girl. I mean, well, he's also been dragged a lot. I guess he's, I don't know what he refers himself to. He refers himself to a girl or a guy. But, but he's just so, you know, um, you know, he's just kind of like, he's kind of like, well, um, that's too much, you know, like your boyfriend robbing you. That's just sad, you know, but, but, you know, it's crazy what people will do, and it's just like, I mean, I don't know what, he, I, I don't know the whole story. I don't watch Jeffrey Star very much, but, but I'm like, well, I do watch him sometimes, but I'm like, I'm like, I have no idea how that could happen to someone that famous, you know, you think you wouldn't do that. But for some reason they did. So anyway, um, I hope everyone has a good Christmas this year. And I want to thank you all for watching. I really feel like I've really done a good look this year in terms of my look. And I'm really looking forward to 2021, what I can accomplish and how I can make my dreams come true. Now, the thing is, I'm not, I'm, I'm not sure when I'm going to be famous. I really don't know. I almost feel like it should have happened by now. But... It does take time, you know. And there are some people that are like, I'm not sure if you have a channel, you might be feeling the same way. You're like, I have the look, I have, or I have the talent. So you don't have the look, but you have the talent. Or you're funny, or whatever, and you're just like, when is it gonna happen? Like, I just feel, you know, I'm, I'm not sure how you feel about that, but it's like, I feel like I'm so good, you know, but, but, um, but, you know, um, uh, there, there are times where you're just like, uh, I watch other people, I'm like, I'm good, you know, I'm really good, but I think today is a day where everyone, well, obviously everyone's spending time with their families, and everyone's really enjoying Christmas, and which is what I'll be doing, and I can't wait. So obviously, um, with the 2021 coming up, I think that'll be my year. I'm really looking forward to 2021 being my year. I really think that'll be my year. I'm thinking that I'll be famous in 2021. Um, now... Sometimes it happens overnight. Sometimes you really, you really gain popularity overnight, and it, it shocks you, and you're just like, oh my god. But I really feel that I'll, I'll be famous in 2021. But I also, I also thought that in 2020. But, <laughs> but you know, sometimes you don't know when it's gonna happen, and there could be funny elements in that too. I mean, obviously, I'd rather be famous now. Um, but you know, I mean, for me. I don't mind, like for me, it's not a big deal to not be famous. Like, I don't mind not being famous right now, but I would love it if I was getting paid on YouTube, you know, like at least that, right? Like, um, and if you guys are out there thinking, oh my goodness, I have a channel too, and I work so hard and I'm not getting paid, you know, it's, it, you're just thinking how, but there's so much competition out there. It's crazy, but I really feel I have an edgy, an edginess to me, a good look, and I have a great voice when I normally have a normal voice. Uh, so I really feel that it's going to 
be someone that's almost obvious. Like, I, I find it funny because I think, I think people will film me in one of them in public or whatever or something like that. I think they can tell I'm going to be famous when they just film me and stuff and they're just like, okay, they know, they know, right? Like, they just know. So they kind of have like all these, all these cameras on me and when I'm in public and I'm like, not that many, but I mean, it's just like, I'm not feeling people will film me and stuff. So it's like, um, and I mean, I don't think anybody really knows about me. I don't know how that happens, but people will film me and stuff, and people will be like, get my picture taken with them, which I'm very flattered by. Thank you, Ken. Uh, or people will do stuff, and I'm just so happy about it, you know. But but it's like, I think everyone knows I'm going to be famous through something. I think it's very obvious. But, but you know, it's kind of like, well, you know, you have to pay your dues, you know. As good as you think you might be, which same thing with me. As good as you think you might be, or as gorgeous as you think you might be, you really have to pay your dues. It takes time, and you can't just be like assuming things. You have to wait it out until it actually happens. So you know, I'm working my butt off, trying to get there, doing a good job. I'm really trying to hold my own here. Um, I really want to make sure that I take the right steps. You know. I mean, there's nothing I'm doing wrong, it's just that it takes time. But anyway, um, thank you so much. Merry Christmas. Bye.